Hello the kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of The Shadows of Mordor. Alright, when we left off, I had been trying to get a uh, possibly better perfect follower, and uh, this is a fresh reforge, because the last one, um, failed. <laughs> We've had several failures since, um, and this is just another show of how fucking insane my RNG is that I have another of the Blackgate character, Felgrat, here, who, um, looks pretty good, I mean, <laughs> considering, if we zoom in here, um, Toker, I was, I have not been able to find a character, but this might get pretty close, I mean, muscular build, uh, not that, you know, goofy looking, <laughs> and, I mean, he has a sword. <laughs> There's that. I mean, he's not dual wielding, but hey. And, uh... I mean, the armor set looks decent enough. It looks like he's probably gonna end up with full metal armor, which would be a plus, considering, um... Rosh over there is not in full metal armor here, like I would approve of. So, there's that. And he already started off with, like, an invulnerability of ranged, if I... Yeah, I saw that right. And a hate of grogs as well. Hopefully we can uh, get something you know, more useful out of training him up. But he's already at level 6, which is a good sign, considering that he has invulnerability to range already. So let's see if we can fine-tune a little more good stuff out of him. Huh? That's not a good group. I will end up dying there. <laughs> How about over here? Huh? Beautiful. That's what I wanted. Rebuild that up. Oh, you little shithead. Oh, you little shit. Oh, I'll just kill you. Fuck you. Already branded the other guy. Perfect. And dominate. Beautiful. Alright, and let's throw that death threat that we're supposed to do, huh? Makes it easier to get stuff done. Alright see how the growth will go. And with the death threat, he gains invulnerability to stealth and monster slam. Okay. Okay. That's fine. I guess. Ugh. Alright. So. That's a problem. <laughs> Uh, of course it is, but we can work with this. We can try and make an ultimate defensive black gate person. We can try. <laughs> but we'll see how it goes. Alright, first I'll need to find him, I guess. I should probably do that. Um, also, by the way, it's cold. <laughs> it's cold here. Uh, it's cold enough that I can circumvent it, but at the same time, some of my extremities, like my nose, are actively rebelling against me. So, <laughs> there's that. Let's mark him. He's all the way over there. Jeez. Okay, well, let's go to the map. That makes it easier that way. And... fast travel. There we go. Perfect. And then we'll see how the growth goes from there. All right, beautiful. Now, where is he at? Should be relatively close by, shouldn't he? There, maybe. Yes. There he is, and the texture for the armor is warping. <laughs> because he's crouched, and no one knows how to model armor, you know, in proper ways. Skyrim can't do it. <laughs> okay, there we go. This might work out. Ooh, already damaged. Beautiful. And... Oh, yeah, that's right. He's invulnerable to range. Maybe someone nearby him. There we go. And then... Come in for the kill. Beautiful. There we go. Let's try and kill... All the ones that'll become a problem. There we go. Whoop, hey there. Ha! <laughs> You're in my way, buddy. Whoops. Wasn't ending you, but that's fine. Hi there. Where is this death you foretold? Where is this pain? 
Uh, not coming for you quite yet. But, eventually. There we go. Well, I can grab him anyway and dominate him. That'll be faster. There we go. Beautiful. And... Let's see what we can command him to do, huh? Let's command him to go after Mugrish, the poisoner, huh? Because, uh... Shares same face. <laughs> Thus destroy. Now. Alright. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Alright. Ambush now available. Ambush in which direction, though? Is he getting ambushed, or is uh, the poisoner getting ambushed? That's the question that I cannot answer. Ooh, it's right nearby. Beautiful. Gotta love that. Yeah, whose days are number? Mine? Eh? Eh. About that. It depends on if you're good enough to kill me, which none of you are. Alright. And ambush. Beautiful. Let's see how this goes, huh? Keep moving! I wanna break some bones at home! Well, um You're not gonna get to have some of that. <laughs> Cut out their eyes. Cut out their eyes. Oh wow. What are you planning on using them for? That's what I want to know. I wonder, would this be far enough to reach? Nope. Would not. Okay. Well, I tried. Oops, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to check his. Mugrish. It's clumsy, obviously. And vulnerable to stealth finishers. He also has regeneration, I noticed. Mugrish. Huh. Maybe we can get... Maybe we can get him to pick that up, huh? Well, kind of need to start taking out some of his defenders first. That way, uh... There we go. That way Felgrath can eventually come and get him. Whoops. They noticed me. Time to run. <laughs> okay, beautiful. And there comes the rest of the ambushers, and now their attention is diverted. Wow, the one guy who I left behind to defend him is actually doing pretty good, considering. Not bad. And he's just flicking that sword of, well, like a little knife. The time him. is up. Don't bother resisting. Yeah, well, he really shouldn't. <laughs> but he's going to try anyway. God's knows. All right. Okay, you are not going to get to kill him yet. In fact, if I'm going to do anything, I'm going to let Felgrad be the one to kill him directly. So everyone else can fuck right off. There we go. That works just fine. All right. Whoop. Oh no. How? How did he manage that? How did he manage that with like half health? Okay, I gotta give him props for that. That was impressive. Huh. <sighs> But that means I'm back to the drawing board. <laughs> uh, hi there, buddy. Now you're gonna die. Yes, hi there. scratch, you're dead before your stupid brain knows it. Yeah, apparently that was what happened to Felgrad. So I'm just gonna take this into my own hands here. And woo! Yep, there we go. I'm not gonna even let you touch me, motherfucker. Woohoo! And you're gone. Ooh, that was immediate. <laughs> Alright, well, fuck. That puts me right back to the drawing board. Ah, man. Ah. We got Gunza Brawler over here. Gunza. Who is a combat master. There's that. Nah. Uga Kuga the Large. How about that? <laughs> yeah, he is pretty big, considering. 
Uh, man. All right, I'm just going to reforge. Give me a second. All right, and another take, and... <laughs> okay, we got one glutton already. Nahug the Greedy with a spear with a rat on it. Okay, that's that's a good that's a good look for you, buddy. Um lat bag of the spiders, huh? Huh. Well Got a poison weapon. That's a good stat anyway. Uh, not what I'm looking for though. Uh anything good in this department? Let's see. Well, we got this guy here, Ratlug the Dreamer, who is also a berserker with the crow outfit. Hmm. Curious. Let's get a look at him, huh? Also, he's a level 9. What was this strength set again? I didn't quite see that. Uh, he's invulnerable to ranged, got a savage weapon, rapid attack, body slam, and fast runner, and a hate of ghouls. Hmm. And he's also vulnerable to combat finishers and a fear of characters. Hmm. Let's see what we can do with a, uh... Quick death threat, huh? There we go. And dominate. And death threat! see how he goes after that. See where his strengths go. Well, I mean, pretty high-pitched voice there. That's something. Pretty high-pitched yell. And of course he gets invulnerability to stealth. Of course he does, because that's just my RNG luck. I never get Combat Master, do I? Ah, it's always fucking invulnerable to stealth. I get tons of black gates, but they're always invulnerable to stealth. Why me? <laughs> uh, Jesus. And he gets boomerang throw, which means his axe is turned into those little sickles. Probably. It's just not showing it right now. Uh, anyway. Let's see where it's at. Um, all the way down there. Okay, so just need to fast travel up there to make it a little easier. And if I find a Karagor just out and about, I should be able to use it to mount up and get closer. No, just one in a cage over there. Oh, man. Alright, um. Kill this one anyway. And. There we go. Charge the arrows that way. Beautiful. And then there's an Uruk over there. There Just look like. Clean out your ears. Stop okay, well, there's that anyway. Take this. And maybe there's one over on the other side that I can use as a way in. Um yes. Yes there is. There's several actually. Beautiful. Um there we are. Get you. And the other ones notice me. That's fine. Nope, you're not going to get to do anything. <laughs> oh, that's my style. Jump quickly in, and then turn the enemy against each other. <laughs> oh, that's so much fun. Hi there. Uh, you're not going to live. At least not long enough. Okay, let's go after you. Oh, hello. Uh, well, there's that guy. I think that's a guy over here. Yes, it is. You can kill these guys in the meantime. Because they're in the way. And kill you. And kill you. Oh, geez. Okay, I missed. Yep, he got the sickles all right. Like I, like I thought they were. Your curses and promises have no dominion over me. Really? They have no dominion over you. Then how did I manage to get as far as I did, huh? Whoop, oh, jeez. Okay, well, that's what I did it. Not at all. Well, a little bit of focus is better than none. Come on, damn it. Oh, jeez. 
Oh, jeez. Oh, fucking duck. Come on now. Whoop. Okay. Nope, you're not getting to live. No, no you're not. Oh, nope, you're not getting in my way. Oh, fuck, he's already at the alarm. Well, sh fuck me. Yeah, boomerang weapon is not what I had in mind. Really now? Is that what you're going to try and do? Right now, you're not getting very far. And... Woo! Okay. Nice damage. This is all too much bother. You buy next time. Will I now? Right now, I'm starting to think. If I blow this up, <laughs> knock me back, but kills you dead. <laughs> okay. Well then. Here is your end. Yep, and that did not pan out like I had hoped. Ah, man. Anyone else? Any berserkers? No, of course not. Because I usually only get one or two, and they never turn out the way I want them to. Damn it. Okay, let's do another reforge. Give me a moment. All right, and take three <laughs> within this episode. Huh. Well, that's... That's... Noruk Blackthorn, okay. That's a look. Thrak the Friendly, oh boy. That's in there. Gunza the Corrupt, another Berserker with the Crow outfit, okay. Alright. But he has a lot of weaknesses. We'll try and breed that out of him if we can, huh? But, uh, for the sake of looking around, let's see. We got Pugrish, Ghoul Slayer. Oh, he's got the boomerang weapons. Eh, that's not good. That's not my particular favorite when it comes to this. Uh, we got another dual wielder, Ortha Blackblade. Hmm. Vulnerable to ranged attacks, mounted beasts, but hates Karagors and ghouls? How's he vulnerable but hates them? Well, I mean, I guess you hate what you're weak to. I guess. Does Superman hate Kryptonite? Batman hate poverty? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I'm not entirely sure how that works out, but hey, we'll find out. Anyway, let's... Well, we have a couple of them here. Let's uh, get a good bit of those going. That wasn't who I had in mind, but that works. In the meantime, I can dominate this guy. Or the other guy runs away. Death Threat... Death threat this uh, Gunza guy first before we do anything else. See how he turns out. Although, to be fair, he was at level 3, so no wonder he had a lot of weaknesses. Well, gotten most of them out, and he's still vulnerable to stealth finishers, but he hasn't got much else, and he's got a boomerang throw, which means his weapon is churn churned, turned into those fucking sickle weapons that I'm not too fond of. Well, that's unfortunate. <sighs> Alright, well, let's try this. Alright, dominate. And we'll see how the other guy goes. Uh, with a black blade. There we are. He's already at 8, so let's see where he goes. To be fair, I like the look of those weapons, so, I mean, I'm hoping he keeps those. Alright. Not bad, but once again invulnerable to stealth. Motherfucker. <laughs> Every time. Okay, hate of Karagors, that might serve us in the long run in Shadow of War. I don't know yet. None of us know yet. Um, heavy attack, decent, very decent, actually pretty good. Vault Breaker is kind of on the edge of worthless. Um... Rapid attack is good. Inspiring presence is great. However, fearless is something that we would have gotten if we branded him. So that's a bit disappointing. Hopefully, if we brand him, it forces out Vault Breaker. Here's hoping. Okay. We'll go after him next. Huh? See how he turns out when we give him a branding. All right. Uh, and he's over there. Which is not that far. But, uh, to be fair, it's easier just to fast travel over there. So, here we go. It's not available at this time? What? Did I do it too early? 
I did too early. Okay, motherfucker. Every time. It's every time. There we go. I'm just too eager to do the fast travel. Because it's so easy. Alright, well. Let's see. Is he down there? Goons. No, that's Gunza. But he's vulnerable to stealth finishers, so... I wonder... If I can manage to kill him before he notices I'm here, just for shits and giggles. Okay, up we go. And down. Beautiful. And. <laughs> okay. Like I said, it was for shits and giggles. It's kind of worth it. You command in death? Not many, if at all. Okay, so he's not over in this section of the map. Let's go further down. And see where he is over here. Um. Uh. Not that way. <laughs> it's easier if I go in the direction that has more ground to cover, which is over here. Oopsie doodle, I got myself uh, turned five different ways. Well, there's that too that you guys probably should be doing. Just keeping me from blowing things up, but it's just so much fun. Okay, where is our guy? Is the question that I do not have an answer to yet. Ooh. Right in the kidney. That, you're, you're, you're not going to feel that in the morning because you're dead. Okay. Ah. Well, there's a free running Karagor. Maybe I can use him. Oh, he's hiding in the bushes, huh? Well, now you're my mount. <laughs> Let's see if I can find the guy because running around might bring him out into the open. He phrase might. I have no guarantees on literally anything in life. I mean, I ran through here before anyway and got nothing. I got bupkiss, so... Let's try it. Whoop. Whoop. Uh, maybe that's him. Yeah, that's him. And his hate of Karagors. I forgot about that. And his sword went through his head. Oh, uh, that's sort of... Uh, sort of goofy animation is what I live for. Okay. Well. Whoop. Okay. Let's jump off Karagor and see how this goes, huh? Oh, jeez. Oh, God. I notice how pretty much all of his guys are just the big guys. It makes it difficult to, you know, get what Toker was looking for. There we go. Okay. There we are. Who's that anyway? Dagman. Yes. I've heard your threats, but have you seen my black blade? Well, I'm, I'm, I kind of can from here because you have two of them. Honestly, you say that like it's, it's you know means something, and he killed the not fat one. Okay, great. Fantastic. Thank you, Karagor. Jackass. There we go. Kill you. And oh jeez. Okay. Up to me, is it? Yep. Okay, that I forgot he had bolts. Which works against me, but not so much other Uruks. There we go. Stop. Well, I can waste the time all I really want. There we go. Oh jeez. That did not work out for me. Ooh jeez, I forgot the rapid attack. Is that fucking hard to beat? Come on, you get out of my way. Fuck you. There we are. Get you with that one. Oh, jeez. And then get you with this one. No, not really. More on trying to get you out of my way. Oh, jeez. Ow. Jeez. Jeez. Okay. There we go. Get some good hits in. There we go. And let's do a dominate. Beautiful. All right. Command you to murder uh, the P 
CUNY. Fuck it, why not? <laughs> so rude, but hey, it's right there. Alright. Ooh, this episode's getting longer than I intended. Okay, it's a duel nearby. Of course not. It's all the way over here, but at least it's close to one of these forge towers. Now my coffee's gone. Okay, great. Let's, uh... See how this goes, huh? Beautiful. Oop. Didn't expect the roll. <laughs> okay. And... Duel. Let's see how this works out. Oh, the bridge. This makes it really easy to get a close-up look. Do you really think you have a chance against me? I'll pop your eyes out with my own fingers! Whoa. That's a... That's a threat, alright. Pop out your eyeballs with me own fingers. Alrighty. Beautiful. Whoops, you know. That's not what I wanted. Alright. Oh, he's getting rocked. Next time, you piece of shrock, you won't be so lucky. Oh, you're gonna run? <laughs> okay, well, there's that. Alright. Beautiful. Well, I mean, good for Otha anyway. Let's see how his strengths go from fighting Mozu. Alright. And... Not much has changed. He's still vulnerable to con... Well, I mean, damaged by combat finishers. That's about it. Um, he did lose Vault Breaker, but he gained Grapple, which is... I mean, not the worst skill to have, but not perfect. But Inspiring Presence is probably going to be his strongest selling point, honestly. Well, we'll have to see how he goes from here, but for right now, I have to end this episode because we are way the fuck over time. <laughs> and I was also trying to show Toker just how bad my RNG is. This is the closest I get. <laughs> the closest I get to anything good I want. So... Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments. We're going to bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat. Playing games and... Fucking around in Nemesis Forge until the game releases. Because at this point, I'm trying to make a perfect follower and the game gives me nothing for you.